everybody, YouTube. It's me, Maria, or Magnetic, and we're back for more Five Months Z7 Reaver. Yay! I'm so excited. We have just left Calm. So now we're in the grasslands, and oh my god, it's so overwhelming because there's so hecking much, but it's also so absolutely wonderful to finally be able to roam the open world of Five Months Z7. I can't wait. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I had so much fun. And if you want to be a part of it life, I'm streaming it currently on t <laughs> on twitch.tv fortune. <laughs> I'm streaming it currently on twitch.tv forward slash magnetic. So come and join us. And if you want to see any of our other socials, they're just below in the description. But thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoy. Welcome back, everybody. We're in the grasslands. Uh, we've actually just picked up our next, like, guidance on where we need to go. Um, Hello there. We need to go all the way down here. And there's all of this. I don't know if we're ever going to make it past all of this. This is kind of wild. Thanks for the follow. I appreciate it. Welcome on in. Um, I haven't even gone all the way up here, but we can actually unlock all of that if we find Chadley. Chadley must be somewhere, right? Have I been up there? Anyway, we're going there now. Thanos! Hi, how are you? By the way, Chad, new month! So we're back on our hopes to get in the PP again for this month we hit it last month so theoretically if we all stay the way we were last month it should be fine um so we'll see right oh, i was hoping you had a conversation i could listen into Also, we have another goal, and um, if we reach 125 new subs this month, okay, a 12 hour stream next month. Plus, I promised if we were to hit the uh, partner plus goal, the plus program goal, which you did last month, you'll get a 12 hour stream this month in March. So you will get one. Windmill Settlement. Hello, Windmill Settlement. Yes, this is the second part of the remake. God, the music is so stunning. Uh, I love it so flippin' much. Look at that! Ugh. Do I not want to make you jump in there? Because I want to jump into it. That view though, right? Sorry, I just destroyed all these boxes. Hello. Magnificent, isn't it? Mm. A Republic original. Hmm. If only there was some way to get it moving again. She wants us to get this moving again. Wait a minute. I don't know. Do we think this is going to be like a side mission and I need to pick it up from Chadley or someone first? Instead of just running around like a banana? Can I not just jump off? For reals? Can jump up this way. I make your windmills turn again. Hi, Shashin. I have to say the Final Fantasy games have always had a good world build out. Mm. 
Listen, this I've been very excited for this one. F first off, what I wanted to say last yesterday, but I didn't want to focus too much on it. I have to tell you, the way they've so truthfully to the original have done the Nibelheim flashback and everything has been phenomenal. And it makes me very excited for some scenes that we're going to get to in this game uh, and to exploring them to see how they've done that because I think it will they just know you can tell that they know how much we care about the game and they put so much love and effort into it and you can just feel it you can feel it in everything that you do it oozes from it you know what I mean like the bits that they recreate so faithfully to the original, but like make him even better. It's just, it's so good. And I mean like dialogue pieces and stuff. They're just like the same. And it's just really nice to see. The whole Nibelheim flashback, everything was, I was so well recreated and I'm just obsessed, you know? So I'm excited to see where it goes. You have good news? Tell me, tell me, what's the good news? Sorry for breaking all your boxes. Anyone need some carrots? Hello. Sorry, I feel like someone's literally knocking over all of your stuff and it's not- Why, Red? Alright, I guess we should make our way to where we actually need to go. But I can see so much stuff that I want to explore. <sighs> Do you know what I mean? Like, there's so many places I want to go. And that I don't know where to start. Which isn't a bad problem to have, let me tell you this. But it is definitely a problem that I'm having. There is Novi Pavlovi? That's really great news. I'll do it after stream for the next time. That's super good to know. All right. Um. Ooh. Maria, I wanted to say thank you. You have jumped into my top five streamers. My what? I love being here. The vibes, the conversations, everything. So thank you for that. Wait, that's so sweet. Thank you so much. That means a lot. You can't say these things though. Today, I'm very I'm vulnerable emotionally, so you can't say this. <laughs> Thank you. That means a lot. Thank you so, so much. And thanks for always popping in, you know? I appreciate it a lot. Hoa! Use assess on an enemy to reveal its elemental weakness as well as effective strategies to use against it. Then exploit those to pressure and ultimately stagger your foe. Allow me. Uh, allow me. Ice and fire. Exploring the elemental weakness will pressure them while their guard is up, landing powerful offensive abilities from behind. Pressure them, but also cause them to cause them to see red. <laughs> it's fine, I know. <laughs> but Nova. Ow. Take a lot of my help, do you? Do we have a good cool off. Nice! Look at that! And staggered. That's what you call the 10 out of flipping 10. Very good proficiency bonus game. I'm what did I pick? Fire out there, please. Oh, that was so lucky. Oh, we have a synergy ability with no one. 
Utilizing ATB commands uh, will grant character synergy. When two characters share enough synergy, you can activate their synergy abilities. These abilities not only deal tremendous damage, they also apply unique buffs such as increasing limit breaks, granting unlimited MP, or extending the duration enemies are staggered. Note that repeated use of a synergy ability will increase the amount of synergy required to activate it. Eight months in the Slavery space and still Darth Jagger is the first person to ever greet. SMH and H. Eight months in this lovely phase and still love Jai is the first person to ever greet? What do you mean? Hi, John. Welcome on in. I hope you're doing well. Thank you so much for the eight month resub. I really appreciate it. Thank you. I hope you're doing well. Thanks for coming in. But we don't have this. Why does it say I have it available? That's the way to do it. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I want to pick the flowers. Um, listen, I think the music is a little bit loud. I, I love the music very, very much. Very, very much, but I think I might need to take it down a bit. Hi. Let's continue our little walk through wherever we're going, really. I'm just trying to unlock the map. <laughs> oh. Yes, I do. <clears throat> Hi, friends. Would you like to get attacked? <laughs> Deal with that. All right. Watch and learn. Kiss my ass. Bound, bound, bound. You got this. Let me handle it. Bring it. Oh, rude. Yeah, um, where's Cloud? Cloud, I need you to. I want to assess this little banana. Have I assessed this person yet? Too bad. <clears throat> I have not. Of course they're weak to ice. They always are weak to ice, aren't they? Aren't they always weak to ice? Hi, Phil. How you doing? Welcome on in. Hi. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you, Novi. I'll have a proper look after stream. Ah! Chat! It's a chocobo stop! Oh, but I can't do it yet. Oh, is that because I have not got a chocobo yet? Okay. I guess that's good to know. Oh! Wait. Is Chadley here? Some enemies will occasionally bind party members with unblockable attacks. If your character is bound, you un and unable to act, quickly switch to a different character. We are too heckin' good. What can I say? Oh wow, look at the... Do you think something will be behind... Something will be behind the waterfall? I mean, I'm gonna have a look. First... I don't think he's here. Maybe we'll have to wait, and then we'll have to come back here. These are the ones that you have to activate to obviously see the rest of the map, like in mini games. 
Yeah, they're all with me, but not in my team right now. Oh my gosh. The haptic feedback on this is perfect. I like that the game has real-time combat, but still skills that pauses the game. Gives a feeling that it's still a bit turn-based, like common Final Fantasy games. Like. Well, I mean, it's not classic, classic turn-based. This one was never really turn-based. It was uh, timed-based more than anything. So you still have exactly that. You have to build ATB, but instead of just waiting around like in the original, where you just wait and the enemy might attack you twice while you're having to wait to be able to do an action, uh, you can actually attack actively, which I think is really neat. I really like it. <laughs> That's why I like it. Yeah, it's a really nice blend. And people who don't like the um, actual action, you can turn it off and then the <coughs> AI will fight for you and you'll just have to um, wait until the ATB fills up and you can do an action on that. Magic or <coughs> a skill. Magic or a skill. Ooh, boxes. Nothing in there. Uh, how did I call that? I didn't even mean to call that. <laughs> All right, do you know what? I think I should probably follow a little bit of the main quest before I continue to like lurk around because I feel like maybe some of this might open up a bit more. Oh, I need to heal. Do I have heal? I have heal. Hi, Shampi! How's it going? Welcome on in! Pretty turn base is a hit or a miss? <coughs> <coughs> when is it a hit? <coughs> I don't know what's wrong with my voice. You love it? <laughs> but is it? Is it actually? I thought you still get attacked even whilst you're waiting. If the enemy's attack fills up. Enjoy the lurk! Captain Sinner, appreciate it. Thank you so much. Okay, so we'll have to come back here because this is a poke Pokemon stop. <laughs> a chocobo stop! Hey, mates, what up? Bring it up. Wrong game, Maria. My brain is that fried. <laughs> Take the lead. Guess it's my turn. What a shot! Suck one, this. Where's this bloody wolf? Weapons 101, mastered focus shot ability. Hey, let's go! In my head, I'm like, I thought this was already mastered, but apparently not. Are you telling me? No! There we go. I want to do dive kick because I assume that's why there's a it's, yes okay I the reason why there's a little dot next to it is because that's an ability I can master here it comes was never in doubt that makes sense I like that. I like that. I got it, see, I got it, see, you know, to make me feel better. Da -da 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 -da. I don't know, this is. Okay, listen, this is so overwhelming to me because I love it and I want to go everywhere. And I don't know where to go first. If that makes any sense. You know? Like, look, there's all of this. This is where I came from, isn't it? And then this is where we gotta go. I can't. This is too much. This is too much. And then there's stuff everywhere that I want to pick up. What? How is this meant to work? <laughs> I already had a coffee and because I feel like so like 
if I'm emotionally unstable, Nova, I don't want to add more caffeine to my body. <laughs> if you know what I mean. <sighs> okay, I feel like all of these places, there's probably something there, but... I think right now, we might not be able to do much with it. Which is fine, I'm just trying to have a look around, really. And enjoy enjoy the glorious graphics of this. It looks stunning. Yeah, no, I try to avoid that, Phil. I try to avoid that. Oh, hey, little wolfies. I'm not fighting you. I probably should. Ah, oh, they seen me. Smack! A toxie rat! But, um, have I assessed this one? Best do it right. Don't think so. Okay, you're there. So I changed the setting based on someone someone's advice, and I actually think I like this. So, do you wanna know what it is? Keep it together. Hope you don't mind if I fill you for the hole. All done. Hey, we all leveled up. Let's go. Mark, thank you so heckin' much for the one year resub. What the heck? How has it been one year already? Thank you so much and thank you so much for the tier 3 sub. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Two more months. Chat, if we can keep up our points the way we did last month, then we should be able to get the plus program into the plus program and get a 70 30 split so thank you so much mark i really appreciate it obviously don't get spoiled thanks for alert keys Aww. i appreciate you thank you oh my Hello? god <laughs> You did it! Thanks for a follow, I appreciate it. Look at those, right? They look cute and adorable, but I'm telling you... Oh, you can't see them. They are not either of those things. Look, they have funky protection on. <laughs> Get assessed! Wait, what did he say? For a second I thought he said I got your number, and I'm like... <laughs> Hitting them with powerful attacks will make them flinch and drive them out from their burrows, pressuring them. Gotcha. Hey, macaroni. Pound, 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 pound! What? Barrett is strong. Dive kick that banana. How? How? No <laughs> hey, where's the other one? Get out of your hole! Let's do this. Ah, here we go. Get brave. What? Gotcha. It's over. Not bad, but not my best. <laughs> Diva, don't be rude to yourself. Not bad, but not my best. So rude. So rude. Thanks for the raid! Wait, did the raid alert not come up? That's weird. Thank you for the raid, Toasty! How are you? How was your stream? Wait, is the bot dead? Somehow? No, it says it's fine. Oh no, it says disconnected. Trying to reconnect. Oh. I'm gonna close it and I'm gonna restart the bot. Rest seems fine, right? 
Watch the whole internet die now. <laughs> I'm not jinxing it, chat! You might be, though. Okay, should be back, should be back! You say this. I saw that you said some. Oh my god. There you go. Sorry about that. How was stream? Did you have fun? Did you have a good time? Thank you so much for bringing everyone over here. Uh, can I just say I love the slight... The scenery change? As in like, we were like in the wide open there and it was really like late and beautiful. And now you kind of go into a more foresty area and it's just like that slight darkness. Because of the trees and a little bit... Ah, oh, we're getting closer to the swamp. And it gets a bit foggy. Oh, it's so cool. I like, 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 like. Oh my god, the swamp. <gasps> the change in music. Oh my god. It did. You did. I'm glad to hear that. Everyone said lots of love to Toasty. Thank you so much for bringing everyone over here. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Oh my god, I'm obsessed. I love this. I love the swampy area. I love how Barrett jumped in, <laughs> but I can't jump in there. Barrett, what's your secret? You cannot cross the swamp without a chocobo. God oh, damn it. Um, we have a beautiful box. Please always open boxes that are purple. Yes! So you get a new, um, a new sword. A sleek saber. Now, I told you when we went in calm that you can get this there. You could have bought it in calm, though. In case you don't find it, you can still do that there. Uh, but we haven't even done focus thrust yet because I'm a banana. So we're going to try and unlock focus thrust first. Before I go and change to Sleek Saber. Um, and we get the Firebolt Blade. Ooh! Nice. That's very, very neat. But not yet. Not flipping yet! Alright, let's see what's up here. No sign of Shinra. Yeah. Looks like an old Republic landing. Could borrow a boat. Make our way across. Then, head on through the mines and keep going till we hit Junon. Sure. Why not? You trust these rotting hulks? I mean, we could. Let's not. <laughs> then maybe we swim it. <laughs> this swamp is home to the deadly Midgard Swarmer. Beware. But even if you're slow, you can rent a chocobo. We'll see you safely past being nothing if not fast. So just give Bill the word and he'll pick you out. A bird! <laughs> <laughs> Why are they so adorable? Well, can we rent some birds? <laughs> can we? <laughs> yes, anything for you. Fine. <laughs> Cloud's like, whatever, fine then. Fine then. Ba ba -ba -bum. The graphics are on point! I know, right? Oh, the bot broke, so we had to restart it. Charge! Wait! Why did that not work? I definitely have it set up. There it is. Did I set it up wrong? Potato night, George. Wait, what? Why would it not work? It works for everyone else. Oh my god, it's so broken here, George. This is your actual result. Oh, I'm... 
am so sorry. I think I dropped a potato. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why it didn't work. That's really odd. I'll have to have a look into it. But George, thank you so much for the 23 months. Wow, almost two hecking years and on a tier three as well. You absolute legend. You thank you so much. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, it did your greeting. That's so bizarre. Huh. I'll figure it out for you. I'll figure it out for you. But thank you so much. I really appreciate it. It's so nice to have you here. Thank you so much for all the love and all the support, you legend. So I have to say, when I played this at the preview event, I was kind of hoping that if I jump in here, Chocobos first, remember? I would get eaten by the giant snake. But if, unfortunately, I did not get eaten. So big satch, you know, big satch. It's fine, though. It's fine. All right, we got to go find a Chocobo. So we need to go to the Chocobo Ranch. Um, which is this way. What a what a what a lucky moment for us to have a sign pointing us in the right direction. Good on us. It's a shame we can't let ourselves be snake, right? <laughs> Ain't that right? Yeah, that's my snake. Look at that little What is that? Are you cute? Don't run away, little mouse. You're very cute. Oh my god, it's so cute! Look, the change from coming out of like the swampy foresty area back into the open grasslands. Absolutely obsessed. Oh, that's where we need to go. So we can just follow this pathway, really. And get stronger as we go. Wah! Unfortunately, I have to focus thrust you. I say unfortunately. Focus Thrust is one of my favorite abilities, so, you know, who am I to not use it, right? Ow! Let's do this. Say your prayer! Say ya! I could do that again. Wow. And we mastered it, so we can swap the... We can swap our sword now, even though I love the Buster Sword. And we can actually... Change this to this. And get a new ability! Let's go! I also want to have a look at the materia in a bit. Um, because I think we can be a bit more efficient with that. I think we can be a bit more efficient with it. A few nights ago, I had the most awful nightmare about snakes. Oh no! Do you want to share or you don't want to relive it? Because I can understand. I can totally understand. Chocobo Ranch. Look at all the gold items we're picking up. Pearl ginger root. Anyone want some ginger? Ah! Another Chocobo stop! But it's... I, I guess we can't turn that up either. The sign. Of course not. We need a Chocobo first. Kapow! Okay, let's try out this new ability we got. Go on, Clout. Firebolt Blade. Gotcha. Holy flips! That's the way to do it. I love Tifa. She's the best. Not much happened, but they kept showing. My parents aren't getting rid of them fast enough. Oh my god. I feel you. That sounds terrifying. So yeah, one thing that I can, like, if that's at any, in any point helpful that I can give you as advice is always try and, like, get your weapon abilities. 
And then you can decide which weapon is for you the best, but in general, I think it's better to have like all of them. You're dead. Gotcha. All of them unlocked. Oh, that is such a super cool attack. Are you kidding me? Just like that, okay? I just love looking at it. Why is it so cool? I like the Buster Sword because it's like a balanced one. And plus it's like the iconic sword, right? So that's why I particularly like it. Like it's not... It's not just um, attack heavy or magic heavy. It's like a nice little balance in between. But it depends on what kind of build you're going for, right? Take the lead. I should probably try and fight with the others a bit more. I just really like them three. So, mm -hmm. Bring it. Heads up. Watch yourself. My turn. Gotcha. This is just such a cool attack. Are you kidding me? Twinkle go below him. <laughs> trying to eat that um <laughs> uh, da, 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 da. Oh. let's be honest it is beautiful yes but in order to get all the other weapon abilities you've got to swap swatch swap over your weapons from time to time that's just what she gets to do Oh my god! We made it to the Chocobo Ranch! Oh my god! Here well, he is! Well. If it ain't my favorite group of hitchhikers. Oh, fancy meeting you here. Thanks again for the ride to Calm. Ah, uh, don't mention it. It's the least I could do for two such lovely young ladies. But I do believe I neglected to introduce myself. The name's Bill, and you can count on me for a lift anytime. Anywho, what can I do you for? You in the market for some fine feathered friends by any chance? Are we ever? Need them to get through the swamplands. Then you have come to the right place. Back in the day, we had Republic ferries to get I us love to this. Indy, but now they're nothing but driftwood, sadly. We got the next best thing, though. Chocobos. To them, a bottomless bog's no worse than a kiddie pool. <laughs> now, ladies, you're probably wondering, what gives <laughs> these birds the power to glide across swamps with ease? Oh, they are so cute. <sighs> Look at them. I love them. Why are they cute? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Would you believe that their fluffy feathers give them the buoyancy to float while their limber legs can outrun a motorboat? Not even the dreaded Midgard Sormer, one of the fastest fiends around, can keep up with them. Oh, wow. <laughs> but you don't need convincing. You just need pointing to a hard-working chocobo. Nature's two-legged limousine. So can we rent some? Sure can. My grandson Billy's in the stable over yonder. He'll help you out. Ah, oh, this is so good! So good! Hi, Tag, welcome on in. I love it! Hmm? There's something I can help you with? Oh, I want to know about Midgar Somer. A chocobo would be nice. Nope, nothing. Ah, uh, that'd be the serpent that lives in the swamp. Longer than a river, quieter than a whisper, and quicker than a lightning bolt. Cause the water to so much as ripple, 
It'll come barreling after you, gaping maw and all. Ooh, gives me chills just thinking about it. Lucky for you, most chocobos can outrun the devil. Though I'm sure you already knew that. Any man of the road would have heard the tales. And judging by that sword, you've been the subject of a few yourself. Of course you have. If there's one thing I know besides chocobos, it's how to spot a seasoned frontiersman. Well, a chocobo will be nice. I, love, I can't wait to see his reaction because he'll be like, what? Emiliata, hi! How are you? Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with the bot today. I'm really sorry. It just really doesn't seem to want to work. Chocoballs! I'm here just in time. Are you excited for the chocoballs, Emiliata? I don't know why it doesn't like us today, but it's fine. You might could talk to Billy over in the stables. He'll be happy to tell you all you need to know. Well, 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 well. Property map. Who has a property map? Is this like a racing place? Because it says like one, two, three, four. Sorry, before we speak to our new friend, I'm gonna take a rest, see what we can buy, and then we'll go ahead. Gonna go head in. Hi, Agatha. How are you? Welcome on in. Oh, thank you. I saw your little Twitter bills of air. Like, you feel well. Guess what? With all your hard work you've been putting in, you deserve it. You're so sweet. Thank you so much. Maria, I feel like you're radiating joy playing this game. Thanks. I love it. My cheeks hurt. Because <laughs> I keep smiling. I'm so happy. Gonna buy a cushion because you never know when we need them. Anything that's. Listen, I'm telling you. Do I have one? No. Anything that's on sale, I'm buying. That's how easy you can get me. <laughs> oh, we should probably look at some of the folios. Um, what is that? A photo booth? I mean, oh, oh my, Tifa! What is your problem with the benches? Are you serious? I just wanted to see if I can go inside of this. And then Tifa, what is it with all of you? Excuse you. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> oh my god! This is getting worse. I'm so sorry. <gasps> I am so sorry. I didn't mean to like run everything over. But here we are. Anyway, um, I want to have a look at the Magnata books. Automat. I mean, we have 10 for each character, so. So we have these as well. Um, powerful Punisher. Increases Punisher mode strong attack damage by 3%. Or. Unleash a wind magic attack without, ex without expending MP. Effect chain attack. Learner's ability to strengthen wind materia spells. Wait, what? Very cool. Unleash an ice magic attack without spending MP. And then what's this one? Perform a ranged attack with your partner. Activate in sequence to trigger a three hit combo. Can use while airborne. We can do physical or magic with uh, Barrett or Red. Yeah, let's do this and then we'll get more HP maybe. Yes. Quite a bit has changed uh, on Remake. I actually made a really, I think, quite cute video on it a little while back. Um, particularly the way you unlock skills um, and the way you do weapon upgrades and that. That's changed quite a bit. People need to stop making their furniture out of air. You do have a point. You know, have a point. Okay. And then this will be a next one. Oh, I want that. I want to have all everything with Atifa. More 
complex? Um, I don't know. There, I mean, this is like a whole added section, I guess, because in the other one, you just have your, your like materia planet like look thing, which has lots of different things to kind of take into account. Whereas they've taken some of that into the weapon only upgrade system and then they have some of them also here. I think there's just a lot more to it. If that makes sense. Uh, Nathan, you can you can call me Maria or Mari, please. <clears throat> I show you the weapon upgrade in a bit. I don't think we have actually gotten one, but we'll see. Um, unleash a lightning magic attack without expending MP. Guaranteed hit. Learns ability to strengthen lightning material spells. Ooh, that's nice. Increases overcharge damage. Yes, I use that a lot. Whenever I change to bear, it's the first thing I use is overcharge. I know you can't see it behind me. I might need to move after all. Um, if I want to get these, we need to get the next one. Mm. Increases damage dealt by basic grounded combo attacks. That's kind of good. And we're going to get this. It's called Leaping Strikes. Team up with a partner to perform a jumping attack. So if you do it with Cloud or a Red, it's a ranged attack. And if you do it with Barret or uh, Aerith, it's a launched attack. Very interesting. All right, and we're not currently using Aerith, but what have we got? Ask your partner to defend you. And then max MP. I think that's a good one for Aerith. Because she can cast stuff while someone's defending her. And then we've got red. What have I got for red? Increase max HP, maybe? Yes. Hi, Jimmy. How's it going? Welcome on in. <clears throat> hello, hello. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Please stop taking the benches with you. I make I'm saying this I actually love this that that that's a thing it's one of my favorite things is that that is a thing I'm doing good it's such a good game oh my god I'm literally just so in love and so happy like this is like my new happy place you know my new happy place an Ari opinion oh Wait, how do I get in? Oh. <laughs> Just like that. Oh! <laughs> Howdy. Saw the sign. Need some chocobos to cross the swamp. I'm sorry, Pops, but you're out of luck. Pops. <laughs> Got no more birds. Last one went this morning. Could have fooled me, kid. These are spoken for. That or they're not fit for riding. Aww. But I can see you're in a bind, so I'll bump you up the list. For a price, of course. Which is? Ten grand each. <laughs> what? Is, we don't have that kind of money. Or any, really. Hmm. Well, there is one other option. Only cost you a grand. Is what a scoundrel might say. But I wouldn't dream of distressing y'all further. Just so happens one of our birds ran off the other day. Wild thing, but still a fine chocobo. If you can manage to find and catch him, then he's yours. Free of charge. You sure? Yeah, why not? Name's Pico. The hardest-headed bird you'll ever meet. By far. 
can use the spitting image of Pops here. <laughs> you can start by looking for his tracks. Find those, and you're sure to find the feet that made him. Now, wild chocobos can be a bit skittish around people. But if you play it cool and creep up real quiet-like, you'll wrangle them no problem. I think we can do that. Thanks. And one last thing. This info comes free of charge, provided you promise to stop by our shop. Speak to Chloe back there. She'll sell you whatever you need. <laughs> Kid's a born businessman. <laughs> if y'all can catch our runaway and get his butt back here, riding and rearing lessons are on me. All right, time to find a chocobo chat. <clears throat> Oh my god, it's oh my god, it's amazing. Need something? How can I find wild chocobos? Start by looking for fresh tracks. Once you spot them, birds are rarely more than a stone's throw away. Birds How do I catch wild, them? They're much more skittish than kept ones. Gonna have to be real quiet on the approach, else they'll bolt. Tell me about riding gear. Gear serves all sorts of purposes, from the cosmetic to the practical. Can even improve a race bird's performance. Well, well, well. It'll cost you a gill. Golden plumes only. Oh. Good luck wrangling Pico. Thanks. I love Cloud's reaction. Why are you all knocking stuff over? I love Cloud's reaction of being essentially called old. <laughs> It's so good. Hops. Oh. Hi, Divided Bye. Hi, Fan Lover. I hope you're doing well. Hi, e Rabbit. Welcome on in. Ooh. We love. Oh my god. Did you see that table fly? Oh, we got a new uh, staff for Aerith. I don't even think I've mastered her initial ability, so I have to go back to that. Oh. <gasps> What have you done? What is this? I can't get out, Tifa. I love how the table went literally flying. What are we doing? Sorry about my brother. All he thinks about is money. He's just doing his job. We understand. I suppose, but he's been a real pain about it ever since our parents left. Aww. Say, are you guys from Midgar? Yeah, the Undercity. Then do you happen to know Chocobo Sam? <gasps> um, not very well, but yeah, I guess we do. Where is he? Probably the Sector 6 slums. He's a big deal in Walt. Um, why do you ask? I was <laughs> thinking about reaching out. It's his fault mom and dad are gone, so... Chloe. That's I'm sorry. Folks business. But they get help. Don't tell anyone what she told you. Sam's one of the biggest names in the business. If he gets wind of that story, our ranch is done for. Don't worry. Your secret's safe with us. I promise. Oh, take these greens. You can give them to Pico when you find him. They were always his favorite treat, you see. Maybe he'll come back once he's had a taste. Right. Should probably sell you stuff, huh? Billy will throw a fit if I don't at least try to get you to spend a few gil. No pressure, but if anything catches your eye. Also, if you have any golden plumes on you, I can exchange them for chocobo gear. So be sure to hand them over if you do. <laughs> a ranch stack shop will have chocobo gear for sale, which can only be traded for golden plumes. These rare feathers can only be obtained, no, can be obtained by wrangling new chocobos or repairing chocobo stops. Now we've already seen two chocobo stops. So I guess we can, um, <clears throat> we can have a little look. So this is where you can also buy some materials for crafting, by the way. If, it, if you're needing any of these. And then this is where we're trading. Oh! So I assume I there's- Pico doesn't give you all too much trouble. It'll be fine. We'll find it. Thank you. Let's go up here. Um, I should probably switch my party up so that I can uh, unlock the um, weapon skills. <gasps> Why is this so pretty? Oh, that's a nice big old window. 
Hey, Bags! How's it going? Welcome on in! I love how Arif was trying to be like, you know, Clouds didn't even think anything. He's just like, yeah, he's a wall market. <coughs> and I was like, come on. <coughs> Did you miss a lot? No, <coughs> not too much. To be honest, no, we're just exploring. Uh, you've missed them absolutely wrecking this place. And it wasn't like I did nothing. They chucked all of this over here. Literally, I did zero. I was just walking. All right, Pico. Where'd you run off to? You mean Pico? Let's try looking for some tracks. Let's try looking for some tracks. <clears throat> Hi! Okay, Mage, how are you? It was so lovely to see you. How are you doing? Welcome on in. Thank you so much for being here. Appreciate it. Thank you. <clears throat> you know the most famous band in Midgar, Arif Smith? <laughs> damn, Bex, damn. Hi! Right, let's have a little look then, shall we? Follow the chocobo tracks. Would you say this is- oh. <laughs> oh, I can see them now. I was like, what do you mean? I can see them now. It's all good. Pico! Cute little Pico! I love the music though. You're having so much fun. I want to play. Do it. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, y'all. Let's go bag us a chocobo. <laughs> I mean, we need more than one, you know. Keep it down. When you're on the hunt, you don't want to startle your prey. Prey? You know we're not here to kill him, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Approach Pico without being noticed. If you are in danger of being spotted by him or one of his pack mates, quickly press circle to roll out of sight. You can also distract chocobos by throwing stones you pick up. Use L1 to aim and square to throw. Okay. What stone am I meant to pick up here? This is terrifying! I love how it says mini mini game checkpoint updated. I mean, so far so good. It's time. Well, how does he throw these ginormous chunks? What does that mean? What do I do now? I thought I meant to throw the foods. Oh god, he's gonna be match. Oh god, am I gonna do it? What do I do when I'm near you? Ha! Yay! Oh. 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 I think I did it! Yay! Oh my god! Pico is ours! Aww. So cute. Aww. Isn't 
he just the cutest? <laughs> Hmm. Why is this so adorable? Look at them. You know, they are kind of similar. Totally. <laughs> <laughs> what does he want now? Do you think maybe he's still hungry? Sorry, that's all the food we had. But you know where there's more? Bill's place. Oh. Back to the ranch it is then. Come on. I am obsessed with this song. You don't understand. It's so good. What about other chocobos? Can I wrangle you? You cutie? Everybody vibing and chilling, yeah? Hip up the chocobo is so good. It's such a good song. Are you kidding me? <laughs> the vibes are real. Them putting stuff into Maria's most anticipated game is Chef's Kiss. What do you mean? Maria, I just wanted to say, when we watching yesterday's what? I died when you went full. <laughs> I saw the full sign. Oh my god, full sign language. It was so funny when I watched that clip. <laughs> New best friend! Yes, Vidyasa! I wish I would have remembered where those chocobo stops were so we could get more plums. It's so good! It's so good! Chat, this is honestly so wonderful to see when you've played the original game. Like, just seeing this whole ranch come to life... Honestly, overwhelming in the bestest way possible. Alright, we brought Pico back! Hey, my friend. Ah, there's our guy. <laughs> Nothing beats a little taste of home, oh. now does it? I love Pico! Huh. Not so much as a feather out of place. Got one healthy bird here. Enough to ride? Sure. Though I wouldn't try till he's done eating. Once he's out of spill, though, I'm sure he'll come around to the idea if we ask him nice. Ain't that right? I'll need to prep his gear and all that, so why don't you wait outside? Fine. <laughs> hey there. What a pleasant surprise. I love you Chadley. Do remember me, don't you? Do we say yes or no? <laughs> I'm gonna say yes. I knew you would. It was an absolute pleasure working with you in Midgar. Thank you again. Your invaluable intel allowed me to create so much materia. Wow! Detecting the graphics? Are we okay? What the hell's this weirdo doing here? <laughs> <laughs> I was created by Professor Hojo, you know. Though your thoughts could be read by any cyborg. <laughs> but to answer your question, AKA Cloud's I an open book. book and skip town. Now, the whole world's my laboratory. Speaking of which, I have a favor to ask, if it's not too much trouble. You need more battle intel. That's the cloud I know. Always eager to get on with it. But yes, though, I'd like you to activate some Remna Wave Towers first. They were originally constructed by the Republic of Junon, but were claimed by Shinra after the war. Since which time they've sat idle and untouched, just waiting for someone to put them to good use. That someone is clearly Chadley. The, the more my processing power will grow, as will the area I can survey. I might even be able to construct a communications network independent of Shinra. How does that sound? You'd not only be helping me, but yourselves as well. If we find any, we'll turn them on. Wonderful. I thought you might say something like that. 
let's get started then. See that tower? <laughs> That's your first target. My favorite bit here is that and like we'll activate it. Oh. <laughs> the Chad module! As Chad, the tower it's you! By, allow me to accompany you. <laughs> Chad, it's you! We got a module from you! <clears throat> it's the Chad module! It's us! You're, the, you're in the game! You made it into the game! Here we are. Listen, Chad Lee spends 95% of his time standing in towns. Why can't he turn on his own damn towers, right? I'm still mad when he betrayed us for another Chad. What do you mean? <clears throat> All right, let's turn this on, I guess. With my fancy new Chad module. Hi, Dan. How you doing? Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. Thanks for being here. Oh, wow. This is... I just... I'm sorry, but like... Are we looking at the same thing? What in the flips is this? This is wildly, wildly beautiful. The graphics, I mean. I mean, Chabby is too. Very beautiful eyes. Power activation confirmed. Initiating preliminary scan of the grasslands. I'll ascertain the locations of fiends and natural resources. Oh my god! After careful consideration, <clears throat> I have devised a new name for this type of research. Okay. I call it World Intel. Chadley, man! You should name everything! Love that! <clears throat> this game is blowing my tiny little mind. Same. Same! <clears throat> Absolutely stunning. Honestly, I can't believe this. Chadley will employ the data you collect to develop new materia, create new combat simulations, and embark on other scientific endeavors. Activate the Remna Wave Towers you encounter and help Chadley deepen your understanding of this world. I hope you'll assist me <coughs> in gathering relevant data by completing various tasks on your travels. In return, I will use the information you provide to develop new materia, quid pro quo. To summarize, I want us to become research partners. But before that, is there anything you would like to ask? Yes, please. Everything. We're going to ask everything, okay? With each piece of world intel you collect, you will also provide me with the data I need to develop new materia. Hey! What I ultimately produce, however, is for you to decide. I look forward to finding out what we can create together. Do you happen to have any questions about world intel and the like? These communications towers were built by the Republic of Junon, in order to further their understanding of the planet. They scan for all manner of signals, which, in turn, reveal myriad locations of interest, such as long-forgotten ruins and rare natural phenomena. Should you happen to stumble across a tower, please activate it. I must urge you to proceed with caution, though. Feral beasts often claim these installations as their territory. Do you happen to have any questions about world intel and the like? I did! I did miss it! I was, uh, I was out getting some food. At the one time I leave the house, you know? I have to pick it up tomorrow, but now I'm extra excited because I was like, I don't know what this is, but... <laughs> now I'm very excited. Yeah, it's just thinking. It must be from you. I'm very excited now. Oh my god. I can't wait. I can't wait. Now I want to stop and pick it up right now. <laughs> With a special pair of goggles, you can do battle in a virtual arena. Regardless hey! Regardless of your real world location. That's the combat simulator. Or my combat simulator. As Shinra developed the stationary models first. And fret not. It will never be obsolete. 
I'll keep it up to date with intel from unique enemy encounters. Lovely. I will also endeavor to implement all of the summons once I finish analyzing the myths and legends surrounding them, of course. In fact, after pouring over stories from the grasslands, I have finished implementing a new one, the tower and colossus known as Titan. Engage him at your leisure. Do you happen to have any questions about world intel and the like? Which particular task would you like to learn about? Oh my god! More! Simply put, give me all the information. Are when the life stream breaches the planet's surface. To Shinra, the volume of Mako that can be extracted from these springs is insignificant, certainly not worth the expense. But to us, they are a veritable oh. font of knowledge. In order to tap these precious reserves, however, you will first need to find them. If you still have questions about world intel, please ask away. While it is normal for creatures to adapt to their environment, sometimes these adaptations make them a threat. I would like you to track down and eliminate these creatures and amass data on them in the process. If you still have questions about world intel, please ask away. A chat lady needs a Geelong didn't read mode? Oh my god. In certain I feel like areas, this is his Geelong didn't read mode. have coalesced into crystalline forms. Though the knowledge contained within them is vast and varied, one subject is of particular interest to me, that of summons. If you would analyze the crystals in my stead, thus extracting said knowledge from them, I can use it to enhance our materia. Ooh. If you still have questions about world intel, please ask away. I have one last one. Ah, yes. I was hoping you would ask. Oh, Tabby is excited for proto relics. My current theory is that they emanate from the remnants of ancient artifacts. But until we investigate, there's simply no telling what the sources might be. And since we have yet to identify them, I have taken the liberty of naming these objects Proto Relics. <laughs> A rather endearing name, if I may say so. At any rate, I would be grateful if you could investigate said curiosities and ultimately recover them for study. If you still have questions about world intel, please ask away. No, I'm done, Chadley. Do you happen to have any questions about world intel and the like? No, Chadley, thanks. In that case, I see no reason not to begin at once. <laughs> With your activation, Chadley's like, power, go out, forget saving the world. I need this intel. Some data. Though hardly substantial, it is enough for me to create materia. Which of these would you like? Oh! <laughs> Chadley is the final boss of this game, I'm convinced. Thanks. Chadley is an android. So I guess technically you're not wrong. Whew, what have we got? I think fire and ice is a good one because then we can use fire and ice. Um, and <clears throat> we don't have to equip fire and ice separately. Auto cast. Uh, not batch. Allows you to turn enemies into items with morph. Enemies whose health has fallen below a certain amount can be defeated in this fashion. What? That is so wild. Auto unique ability materia allows an ally to automatically use the unique abilities. That's cool when not actively controlled during battle. Tifa will also use unbridled strength when not actively controlled if this materia has been equipped. Ooh, I do like, but I'm going to go fire and ice first. Oh, we can get another? That one then. Thanks. I wish you all the best in the long journey that lies ahead of you. Thank you. And remember, you're not in this alone. Should you require assistance, just ask. Did he just get a suitcase, or is that the combat simulator? I was like, it's why did this right, why did the suitcase just come up? It's FC four fifty chair decks one hundred. Thank you for the hundred biddies. It's FC. Welcome on in. Thank you, Dan. Thank you so much for hanging out. I can't wait to check out the package. Thank you so so much. Thank you. Um, assessing and defeating new fiends will provide Chadley with the data he needs to update the simulator with combat challenges. Complete these challenges to earn a variety of rewards such as powerful summoning materia. Speak with Chadley to access the simulator. Summon Entity Titan! Biological Intel, no thine enemy. Grasslands Region Intel, level one. Cloud. 
Chadley. I created Titan, the mythical colossus of the grasslands, in virtual space. I encourage you to pit your skills against this summoned entity so that I might complete its materia. Um. Oh! Still looking super cool. Fan lover, thank you. That was very sweet of you. <clears throat> so, what have we got available here? Summon. We could do Titan. Emerge victorious against these mighty entities in the combat simulator to be rewarded with their summoning materia. If an entity is proving too difficult, you can gain an advantage in battle by analyzing its corresponding summoning crystals found around the world. So right now we can only fight him on his uh, in his full mate, which might he might be too strong for us at that point. Um. <clears throat> um. Look at my new favorite friends. It's on now. Watch this. Get fireballed, bleeding. And then here comes my bestie. <laughs> nice. <coughs> Easy peasy. Don't mind me. Get ready! Can he ha Oh, have I never assessed this banana? Don't overdo it. Oh. I, I thought I wasn't close enough, but apparently I was. Wow. Damn. It's like someone sneezed and they all died. <laughs> Why is the music so fire, though? Hello, little friends. Oh, you're a bit annoying. That's what you are. Three out of five rounds. Have I assessed those? They're weak against winds. And I don't think any of us has winds. Um take the lead. Let me handle this. That'll There, you're up. Get a no thing. Now that was something else. Good work, team. Good work, team. We're on three out of five, I think. Four out of five now? Ah, look at those little bananas. Don't overdo it. I got this. Good luck. About damn time. It's about damn town. Maximum Fury. Let's do this. Let's keep it up. Damn. Damn. Hi, it's FC. Thanks for coming in. Whoa. Ah, <laughs> uh, not those shady wolves. Which one of us has ice? I actually don't remember. Keep it together. All set. Bring it. She has ice, I think. It's on you. Need my help, do you? Oh! 
can can little wolves please leave me alone? Let's finish this. I don't think we have any available. Yay! There you go. Healing materia! <clears throat> Leveled. Nice. That's a nice reward. I didn't even look at the reward. <clears throat> What's the reward here? Ooh! Enemy skill materia plus the enemy skill. Ooh, we should do that. Only one round. A three-person battle in which you pick your team engage. Hmm, let's see. I am intrigued. <clears throat> Margi Wow. Let me handle this. Come on. What? <clears throat> that was straightforward. Love it. Hey, assess enemies across various regions to unlock special challenges in the combat simulator, then complete these challenges to learn new enemy skills. The default skill, Sonic Boom, deals wind magic damage and grants bravery and faith. Will always be available as long as the materia is equipped. <clears throat> Very nice. Look at that, chat. Look at that. So then these are combat trainings. And we also get a lot of materia for this. So we'll definitely I might do those off stream, unless you want to see them. But incredible. Thank you for your contribution. You're welcome. Needless to say, many hazards await you on the road. So take care. <laughs> Thanks, Chadley. I'll be back. I shall be back. Okay, so we have a lot of- <gasps> I can talk to my friends! He's gonna talk to you? Oh, I can't. I can just see that you're not particularly happy with me. What the flips? Hello? Oh, none of them have particularly happy feelings towards me. What is this? What is there, Moogle Intel? Okay, we should go there. But we should grab the chocobo first and do that bit, I think. Whoa, what is that? Phenomenon into one coastal lookout. Ooh. We're expedition into one. And then this is another tower in it. Yeah. Oh, and this is where some chocobos are. Oh, I love it. This is so cool. Oh, whilst we're in this, we might as well have a look at our materia. Um, healing fire. So we could theoretically just swap that for fire. Swap that. Swap that for fire and ice. May as well, right? Assess. What else have we got? See, I love this. By the way, I love that you can flick through and. Instead of going all the way through them from top to bottom, you have your different types of materials there and you can just find them and immediately pop them on. Um. We don't have much materia yet. May as well put steel on. Oh, that's what we picked up! Increases speed by 10. That might be good for Tifa, actually. Barret has nothing. See? I think Tifa being quicker is a nice thing to have. What she got equipped? Ch Chakra and Ice.
So which one have I used? I've used Arcane Ward a few times. So we should probably switch to... We should probably use Erevan Red. And then make use of their... Um, make use of their abilities so we can uh, un unlock them permanently. If you know what I mean! <clears throat> um, let's see... Increase ATB charge for a recharge rate? Nice. Yes, please. I like that skill. What have you got? Unflinching overcharge makes it harder to be interrupted while using overcharge. I like bears have a lot of HP actually. What about Tifa? Martial Arts Mastery increases the duration of unbridled strength. Ooh. Utterly unbridled strength increases attack power. While unbridled strength is active with a 5% boost at chai level 1 and 10 at chai level 2. That's pretty strong. But I like that. Wind damage up increases the wind damage. Not so fleeting familiar increases fleeting familiar duration. That's when you cast Tempest, right? And then this one. Invigorating vengeance restores HP when activating vengeance mode. That is nice. Increases counter spin potency. All right. Let's see. So a red and error of thin cloud. I think that works. Let's try that. Is that my, my current team? Yes. Um, let's grab a chocobo first and then we're gonna maybe do some of these little missions on the on the map. Hey, perfect timing. Pico's all prepped. But first, here. You just give that whistle a toot and your chocobo will Yay! come Yay! Press R1 to use your Choco Whistle and summon your bird to your side while out exploring the world. Note that you can only call the Choco Whistle in a region once you have wrangled that region's bird. Nice. So, who here's never been on Chocoback? I haven't. Why don't we take a few laps to get you comfortable then? Come with me. Hey, practice some Choco riding. I'm excited. Look at Chadley just lurking in the corner. Chadley, why are you lurking? <laughs> you're already following me around. Now you're lurking. All right, all right. Here's where we get our birds in shape for the races. Nice. What races? The gold saucers, I mean. They're a big deal in our community. The gold saucers! We'll find a ranch around here that doesn't compete. So you guys race too? We've been sitting it out since mom and dad left. But we're gonna get back in the fight soon and kick the tar out of one particularly nasty weasel. But never you mind all that. You just focus on the basics, like making sure you don't get thrown from the saddle. Why don't you try hopping on Pico and giving me a holler? Press R1 to call your Chocobo! <gasps> What's the shape of the whistle? Oh, damn. Oh my god! Look at us! Cute. Okay. But how's about we stretch his legs a bit? Use the training grounds on Bill's Ranch to get the hang of Chocobo back. No, Chocobo back riding. Pass each of the goalposts in order and complete the course as quickly as you can. Oh, damn, we get some cool stuff if we get good times. Gotcha. How did I not pass? 
past that! What? Do I need to, like, go through it? Oh. Huh? Oh, I need to maybe just be inside of, like, the... I think I was betrayed, chat. Chocobo drifting! Alright, we'll do it again. That was not great. We didn't even get third. What the flips? Not terrible, but hey, now that you got the basics, it's just a matter of practice. We You're can't thank you enough, Billy. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. Y'all mentioned your flat broke, right? Then you might want to swing by calm again. Now that the troopers have cleared out, it's probably safe for you to ask around for work. Though, don't run off just yet. My sister's looking for help. Not sure what the trouble is. Didn't want to confide in me for whatever reason. Honestly, she hasn't been herself since Mom left. They did dang near everything together. You want to lend Chloe a hand? We need to move on. True, but moving on costs money. Hmm. We had fun helping people in Sector 5, right? Same deal. People the world over are willing to pay top gill for Cloud's hand for higher services. <laughs> to track these odd jobs, open the map and select quests. Certain settlements will have um, a notice board upon which citizens in need will post job offers. Accepting a job will mark your new employer on a map. Tackle the odd jobs listed here to earn rare rewards. Deepen your bonds with your allies and increase your party level. Okay. Many a things. You can warp to any unlocked waypoints such as towns, repaired chalkable stops, and activated remnant wave towers. Uh, press to open the map and select the location to instantly travel to it. Note that you can only fast travel to chalkable stops once you have wrangled the region's chalkable. Hi, Tia's Villa. How you doing? Welcome on in. I need to do What's this. Up? Can I do the ride again? Yes. We can definitely do it. I just... Why? 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 Oh my god. I'm so bad at this chat. I thought it was the Chocobo Drift Queen. And now look at what I've become! Not even second! We can do second. <laughs> Keep riding like that and you'll clean up at the races. I don't know, you know. I don't know. I think you're wrong. Billy. Yeah, you gotta run past them. But not easy. Does that count? No. Does it? No, because it's over 31, right? You're a bona fide jockey, all right. <sighs> all right, all right, all right. We're going to do it. We can do it. Maybe I just do need to drift a bit more. Right? Hi, j Regs. How are you? No. Can we redo it? Scary. Oh, 
Why did I stop there? Oh no. That was even later! <sighs> Chad! I blame you. Oh, that was an awful start. Feed my chocobo with some special snacks. Do you know what? Maybe I could get some armor. Although I don't know. If if there was a reward for walking past these things, I would get it. I would get it. The drifting helps or not, you know? A good start on these. Okay. I blame that my thumb keeps slipping off of the of the controller the stick Genuinely have no words. By the way, chat, everyone check you get any treats. I know the goals are not up. Um But I think we're at I'll have a look in a sec. Maybe five or six subs at the moment? possibly do this any quicker keep riding like that and you'll clean up at the races listen sir how do I make my chocobo faster my chocobo is slow <laughs> Chadley relax oh there was small desk slap I don't even think we have anything for a chocobo yet do we no, we have nothing. This is where you customize your chocobo and make it look even fancier than it already looks. How exciting! <clears throat> Alright, let's see what side quest she has okay. anyway. Flowers? I heard you might need some help. Oh, that's you nice did? of us. 
Oh, I see. Billy talked to you. Didn't She's got you? stunning eyes. I think we need to go pick flowers, but the planes are way too dangerous for that. I'm sorry to hear that. As a flower lover myself, I sympathize. Well, the thing is, I want to make a flower crown. Mom used to make them for us all the time. So I wanted to give it a try, but with all the monsters, I didn't know how I could. Here's an idea. Maybe we could do the picking for you? Sure. Cloud? Thoughts? <laughs> what happened to your parents? <laughs> Ask your brother! Truth is, our parents died in an accident when I was really little. Billy doesn't like to talk about it. Oh, Sorry. We used to go on these family picnics. And after we were done eating, Mom would make flower crowns for me and Billy. I'd wear mine for days. What will you say? How do you know Sam? I shouldn't tell you this, but he's the reason Mom and Dad died. That's what Billy says. I don't know. He always changes the subject when I ask. Really? You will? The flowers grow on a hill that's got a great view of Midgar. It's kind of far, but a chocobo will get you there quick. Thank you so much. We're a one-stop <coughs> shop for all your chocobo needs. Um... <clears throat> <clears throat> All right, none of these actually do anything. But we can get one of them. Um, Maybe a breastplate. If you ever want to change your Chocobo's gear, feel free to use the stable just over there. Don't worry, we will. Right, let's put the breastplate on, shall we? On our chocobo. And we can edit the colors! I love that so much. Oh, I actually quite like the red. But maybe... Oh. Oh, that's color one? I want like a gray, so like this. And color two. I want to be like, I want it to be like a baby pink, I think. <gasps> no, give it back! Oh, flips! Yay, Miriata, look! Cute, no? New discovery mode. Oh, really? All right, so. They also told us to get back here. Chadley's there too? God damn it, Chadley's there. Oh my God, we can go outside that way? Wait, and that's where the flowers are? What? And then this is where we actually have to go. That's the main story. That's not the full game, by the way. This is just the very beginning area. I, I want you to know this. Because we're going somewhere else after that. Alright, let's go here. Actually, I want to see the Moogle place first. How, how about that? Oh, 
I'll eventually do the chalkable race. There's gotta be a way to do it. You looking to practice? Yes, I am. Let me flip and win, man. I need to win! Maybe now that we look more fancy, we can do it. You make me faster? Yeah, honestly, I think as much as I love Remake, this will make it look like, I don't know, baby, you know? Does the running... I don't know. I think it stops me, doesn't it? Does it slow me down? Hmm. Got nothing left to teach you anymore. You do? I want to do it again. I'm not breaking, it's a... Uh, I'm trying to drift around the corner. <laughs> no! Don't get me wrong, Remake was good, but when comparing to this one, I know. But this one's because it's like open world as well. There's so much to it. And there's so much still coming. Like, oh, it's gonna be so good. All right, we did it. Hi! Oh my god. I kind of wish all of them would have the same armor on. It looks so cute. All right. This way. Come, come. Look at us! I just love them all on the on the chocobo. It's so cool. Trash hunting with chocobos! When the quest mark icon appears above your chocobo, buried treasures nearby and waiting to be sniffed out by your feathered friend. What? Obtained a play arts rest spot. Can you go in there? I guess not. This is so beautiful. <gasps> there it is. Oh my God. Look, 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 look. The little Moogle statue is there! Are you ready? Pop inside a mushroom-shaped Moogstool 
a mock stool to get a peek at the lives of the fantastical creatures who dwell therein. That mushroom. Chocobo too! It's so good, right? I love Chocobo so much, right? My fave is Red. I know, Red riding the Chocobo is amazing. That's kind of what Jagger was uh, based on. You know, for a, for a bit and a subler. Oh, by the way, let's have a look. There you go! Halfway to Jagger getting treats. Halfway. Hey, Extreme Apple fan, how are you? Look, one in. Chat, we're gonna go inside. I'm so excited. Enter, yes, of course. Whoa. <gasps> oh my gosh, Cloud is so pretty. to our Moogle Emporium. Oh, oh, I'm sorry to say, we aren't open quite yet, and I'm not even sure when we will be. <laughs> Cloud's definitely thinking he's Those tripping. Those are refusing to come back, and we can't do business without them, Kubo. Actually, maybe you wouldn't mind helping? The Mooglets are having too much fun to come back on their own, so I want you to round them up. And then we can open up the Emporium, and everyone will be happy, Kubo! Oh my god! Uh, Did that Kubo just enchant Cloud? Fine. I'll see what I can do. Thanks so much, Kubo! <clears throat> Chase the Mooglets around the field to lure them back into the uh, mock stool or catch them and escort them yourself. Just beware their playful little tricks. Get hit three times and the game will end. Oh damn, it's a mini game. Bring all five Mooglets back. Oh. Oh. Oh, I got one. I got two. Can you not throw stuff? How do I pick them up? I want to pick them up. How do I? Ow! Press at just the right moment to evade the mogul's mischievous attacks. Note that some of their tricks, like the bombs and banana peels, cannot be dodged. <laughs> one more? Wait, where's the last one? Oh, you're throwing bananas! Listen, I love a banana, though. Yay! We did it! You're a lifesaver, Koopo! You're welcome. <clears throat> Thanks so much, Koopo! Now we can finally open the Emporium! Here you can exchange Moogle medals for cool stuff we found lying around. Everything's great, I promise! Returning all the Mooglets to their Moogstool will grant access to a new shop at which you can exchange Moogle medals for a variety of enticing items. Helping open more Emporiums will increase the Moogles' uh, merchant rank, which will in turn expand their selection. Oh, I love all the pink. It's so cute. All right, we have two Moogle medals. We could get some ether, but 
Wow. <clears throat> Look at the rarity of these. Oh, this is what we really won. The art of swordplay and way of the fist and stuff. Because I think they're going to get all of them. <laughs> Those are the Just ones we really know, want. There are six more mob stools out there, Koopo. So be sure to say hi to my friends if you find one. Also, the more emporiums we open up, the more stuff we'll have for you to buy. That's a win-win situation in my books, Koopo. I agree. Hey! Thanks! Oh, I love the statues! That is so pretty! I love it. Uh, hi, Bella Boy, welcome in. This is more Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, yes. Area of interest discovered. You may find useful supplies hidden among abandoned facilities and settlements. Open all the chests in the location to mark it on your map as complete. Gotcha. I can't stand how cute they are, right? So is this... You may find useful supplies hidden among abandoned facility settlements on the chest. Wait. Oh, there's still one more. I assume it's up there on this one. Hello there. Thank you for the follow. Hello there. Appreciate it. Welcome on in. Or not. Huh. Maybe a top? Oh, maybe it's over there on this one. We got that. What else have we got? Oh, there's a tower. So let's go and do that one. Where's my cute and trusty chocobo? There you are. Oh, look, look at red. <laughs> red on the chocobo is the best thing. Hello there. Oh, there's some beasties down there. How do I get down there the best? Thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. Like that. That's how we come down. <clears throat> Ready to fight. Let's use some of their skills <coughs> so we can unlevel uh, unlevel them. Um, unlock them fully. <coughs> it's on you. Ready when you are. Wow, wow, wow. I'll take care of them. Um. <coughs> Try you, you can do Don't it. overdo it. If you need to find you. I think it needs two. That's why I'm. Oh no! Nice. Someone looks kind of shaky. My turn. Thank no. you. Deal with that. Perfect. Stardust Ray. Cosmos, answer me. Going in. Take over. I'll take care of them. This 
one's for you. <laughs> Proficiency bonus gain. We love that. <laughs> right now, I'm just trying to cast it. So I have more of them, if that makes sense. Born Clare. I got this. Take the lead. We did it! Not that any of them are in particularly good shape now. I just want to unlock those uh, skills so we can... Because we've got a new staff for Aerith, so I want to give her that, but I can't give her that until I unlocked Arcane Ward. Look at the little chocobo being cute. <clears throat> so cute! Hey! And so more of the map will be unlocked and I get more things to do. Look at that. Look at that. I love it. Look how much there is. Like what? I'm speechless. Can we go up here? Hi, Fi, hi! Wow. It's so pretty. I feel like we're gonna be in the grasslands forever now. <laughs> I don't even think we're ever gonna make story progress at this point. I am, um, I think. Maybe we'll do this section first. This, 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 this. And then we can maybe unlock this. Oh my god, we're never gonna continue! I'm just letting you know! <laughs> hey! What an amazing experience this is. We've done a little bit, and I only mean like the smallest bit of story. And then we went and just done so much side stuff. And there's more of the world intel and side missions to come. So I'm very excited. I want to really, really cherish this experience and just go through it for as long as possible. You know, I'm, I'm happily going to stall the main mission to explore the world and experience this together with my favorite characters. If you had a great time, don't forget to subscribe and let me know what's your favorite bit then so far. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.